Hi, this is Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 19th, right? Yeah, around the 19th. But, you know, the timing is fluid, so it is what it is. It's kind of funny, as I hit record, right before I hit record, I heard like a, a phone ring. But the only phone in this room is my cell phone. And it's not, and it was like, it was a very faint ring. It was just like a very, very faint ring. And it was a weird ring. So I don't know what that is, but somebody's probably going to be getting a phone call. Anyhow, let's get started. Keep in mind that not every reading is for you. This is a reading uh, for whoever it resonates with. Just an energy that I am picking up on. So, we have some sort of sadness here. We have sadness, there's lack of growth, somebody's depressed, they're not happy. There's some sort of sneaky behavior going on. This person. Uh, it's up to no good. So we have somebody that is in a dark place and they are up to no good. This is a sneaky, shady individual. Um, it looks like they're trying to get away with something. Uh, and they're very cunning. <laughs> this is very cunning, very coy, very smug. Uh, this is somebody that is making a getaway. They are making a getaway. They, they're Right now they're getting away with it. Um, it's not being seen that they're getting away. It feels like there's a trap though, and I don't I don't know why, but I feel like I feel like they're headed for into a trap, which is interesting. Um, but there's some sort of lack of growth here. Somebody's been lying about something as well. Um, yeah, this is not not a good situation at all with the sun card reversed very shady individual who thinks that they're getting away with something but they're not they're not going to get away with it i just i feel that they're not going to get away with it um there's no growth here there's there's disillusionment there's some sort of disillusionment somebody's not seeing clearly hmm. something could be happening at night as well you know, when the sun goes down, after the sun has gone down, we got somebody here that is up to no good. Put it that way. This is like a dangerous situation, it really is. I feel like we have somebody that is not able to control themselves. They may be acting out of control, um, making a poor judgment call. Somebody's making a poor judgment call. They could even be, well, obviously it looks like they're breaking the law. It does look like they're breaking the law. Um, this is somebody that is it may be leading others into danger or this is just somebody that is untrustworthy um, that doesn't care who they hurt this person really does not care who they hurt they have their own agenda they are depressed they're in a dark place um, and they got some sort of hidden agenda somebody's putting a plan in action um, it feels like it's well thought out plan. This is somebody who has thought out, they've thought it out. And this is somebody, it's like they're doing it with a smile on their face. But it feels like they're going to they're gonna come up against some opposition. I feel like, I really feel like there's going to be some opposition. I do. Um, oh yes, there is. F five of Wands reverse on the bottom. Yeah, there's going to be a fight. There's going to be a fight. There's going to be some tension. This is somebody that, uh, I don't know, this could be an all-out war. It could be an all-out war. I do believe that uh, this person doesn't realize that they are heading into something 
uh, they're heading towards somebody that is going to uh, stop them. It's like they're going to be stopped. They're going to get caught. I really feel like somebody's going to get caught. It feels like they try to escape. They're trying to escape, but they're not going to be able to escape. Ooh, Queen of Raw. Oh, geek. <laughs> I cannot wait until Mercury retrograde is over. Queen of Wands. Now this is this is somebody that is very confident, extremely confident. Um, and this is extremes. When you get a card in reverse, it's extremes. And this is somebody that has a lot of confidence, and they've been lying about something. Maybe it's about health, growth. You know, they've been lying about something. Um, lying about maybe they've been cheating there's definitely been some deceiving um, they've been getting away with it up until now but <laughs> there's somebody that is gonna see something or somebody's gonna get mad and they may tell you know this is somebody that may get upset this person may get upset they may get very very extremely upset and may get extremely upset at this person that they have been deceived by Maybe they've been deceived by somebody that, you know, has betrayed them, you know, has betrayed them in some way. They may have thought they were going to have growth or happiness or even a child with this person. This person cheated them, deceived them, whatever. This, this Knight of Swords is somebody that is angry and reversed. And they may be not be able to control themselves. They may be in, you know, out of control. They can't control their words. They can't control their actions. And it looks like they're going to be... And they keep on looking at this person, you know. They keep on... I feel like there's definitely going to be an altercation. This one has been lying about something. Somebody has been lying about something. They've deceived somebody. And the person that they deceived is... I feel like this person is angry. Very, very, very angry. And I do believe that there's going to be some sort of... Um, Opposition. I feel like there's going to be opposition. Now, this Queen of Wands is somebody that is forceful, very determined, very um, confident. So we have somebody here that is very confident in their abilities. This is somebody who is skilled at whatever they do. So this is somebody that, and I feel like there's, there's some sort of uh, deception here. Ah, going to be some extreme regrets. Whoever this person is that got themselves involved with a dangerous situation is going to be regretting it. If they're not regretting it already, they're going to regret lying. They're going to regret deceiving because there's there's some sort of unhappy news that is arriving or there's an unhappy camper that is arriving. Somebody is not happy. Put it that way. They're not happy that they have been lied to. They're not happy that they have been deceived. And they've been really stressed out and, and losing sleep over this person. This person had some sort of power over them or some sort of control over them. And now that they've been deceived, I feel like they're going to they're gonna come in uh, with a vengeance. This person is going to come in with a vengeance. And they're, they're just not happy about, you know... The circumstances, about the deception, about the lies, about the, I don't know if it's cheating or whatever. Um, we do we do have somebody here that didn't care who they hurt as long as they got their own way. And it feels like this, whoever this person is that did not care who they hurt is going to be having regrets. They have caused somebody a lot of sleepless nights and a lot of anxiety and a lot of stress. And now, and now I feel like the uh, tables are turning. I feel like the tables are turning because we have somebody here that is um, on a mission and they're angry. They're angry. They're not happy. They're not happy with uh, whatever has happened. Oh my God, five of swords reversed. Now this is trying to prove something. Somebody wants to teach somebody a lesson. And again, I mean, the five of swords is, is a person that does not care who they hurt. They just want to win at all costs. 
So we do have an egotistical individual here who, uh, I don't know, this is a hostile situation. It is a very hostile situation. Um, this is somebody that had hidden agendas. They had hidden agendas and they got themselves involved with a person that was emotionally unstable. Um, this person was already in a state of depression when they got themselves involved. And I feel like because they had the mentality that they wanted to win, they didn't realize that they were involving themselves in a dangerous situation by scheming. This is a schemer. This is a schemer that had their own you know, desire to win something. They had their own agenda. Anyhow, the Five of Swords in reversed is a very hostile situation. I mean, there could be, you know, it could be dangerous. Could This could definitely be a serious battle. It could be a serious fight where somebody gets hurt. I mean, really gets hurt. I mean, yeah. I mean, that's what I see. I see that there's, you know, um, there's definitely been some betrayal. And whoever this person is that wanted to win at all costs and didn't care is about to face some opposition. And they are going to regret uh, deceiving whoever it is that they deceived. Whoever it is that they pulled into their plan, you know. Um, we definitely have an unhappy camper here that has been betrayed. I mean, there is betrayal. There absolutely is. There's cheating. There's deception. There's lies. This is a very cunning individual, extremely cunning and uh, smug, very smug. I mean, I see smugness a couple different times, three times. So we do definitely have a smug, smug, smug individual that is going to be experiencing a loss of some sort because the sun card in reverse is a loss. It's a loss of happiness. Anyway, they're not going to be happy with this arrival, put it that way. I do believe there's going to be an altercation, okay? And it could end very, very badly. Somebody could end up in the hospital. And that looks like a hospital bed to me or jail or jail. Anyhow, um, so somebody could, you know, because there's going to be a serious uh, power struggle here. Or there is. There's going to be a power struggle. Whoever this person is that is, 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 thinks that they are in control, they are up against somebody that um, is just as cunning as they are. So that's definitely a power struggle. Anyhow, um... Arrow font reverse. Whoever this person is doesn't doesn't listen, doesn't listen to any advice. This is a know-it-all. This person is a know-it-all. They don't. They're not very spiritual. They don't listen to advice from anybody. They're under a lot of social pressure to look a certain way. They don't abide by rules. They don't follow rules. They feel like they are above the law. This person um, is going to be disgraced in some way, or they have been disgraced, and that's why they don't care who they hurt. This is a broken marriage, a broken commitment, somebody that isn't very spiritual, that doesn't believe. They, maybe they don't believe in karma. They don't believe in a higher power or something like that. They are about, they are about to believe, put it that way. Is that moving? Now this is God. There is a higher power involved. This person doesn't believe. They do not believe in a higher power. They do not, maybe they don't believe in God. They don't believe. They think that they can get away with hurting people. Whoever this person is that thinks that they can get away with hurting people, they cannot. They cannot. They are about to regret their actions. They are. Somebody is about to show up that is very upset. This person is upset. 
They're pissed. They're pissed because they have been lied to, because they have been deceived, because they have been betrayed, because they have been pushed away. This person may have broken up somebody's marriage, may have broken up somebody's commitment. Didn't care who they hurt. Six of Cups reversed. A lot of memories. Somebody is reminiscing. They're reminiscing. They're in their feelings. They can't master their feelings. They're clinging to the past. Somebody may need to go to rehab. Somebody, somebody may need rehab. They may need help. Somebody needs help. But whoever this person is, they refuse help. They will not accept help. There's This is a know-it-all. This is definitely a know-it-all. I do feel like uh, this may have to do with children leaving home or somebody leaving home, the past leaving or some sort of breakup or something. Maybe it has to do with children. A home wrecker. <laughs> There's consequences here. Somebody's going to be dealing with some consequences. This is like stolen innocence, you know, and I just got chills on both sides of my arms. Oh, somebody has robbed somebody of their innocence, you know, or they robbed somebody of, you know, a happy life. They lied, they cheated, they deceived, they didn't care who they hurt. Somebody may have, you know, hurt children, you know, if you win your home wrecker and you break up a marriage, you know, there's something like that. Or commitment I don't know it feels like there's children involved here I think we have an individual that has caused some sort of hostilities they've deceived and they've lied and they are about to regret it okay Bad news. This is bad news. Page of Wands reversed. It is bad news. Somebody's going to be receiving some bad news or there's somebody. We have a negative Nelly here that just wants to bring people down. This is somebody that has a self-image problem. Uh, it refuses to take a new, a new direction. Somebody that is very pessimistic that uh, doesn't look at life in a positive note. Okay, this is somebody that... Um, is extremely depressed. There, there's a lack of growth here as well. So I don't know if there's a child. There's a lack of, I, I know I've said child a couple of times, but so we have children here, we have a child here, we have a child here as well. Lack of growth. Somebody's not growing or the relationship isn't growing. Or there's a relationship did, that didn't grow. It didn't grow. You know, it didn't, something isn't growing. We have somebody here that is very, very controlling. And they're under a lot of social pressure to pro pro project themselves to be a certain image. This person has a self-image problem and they have hurt somebody to fulfill their own needs. Anyhow... I do believe that we, we have somebody that is going to get caught. They may have escaped uh, getting caught in the past, but they're going to get caught now. Somebody's going to get caught. I know they are. They're going to get caught doing something. And it's probably going to cause a fight. Or it could be a fight that that causes somebody to get caught. You know what I mean? 
I do believe there's going to be an altercation. There is. Somebody hasn't been going in the right direction. They've been clinging to the past. And that could be it as well. We may have somebody here that got themselves involved with another person. And that other person thought they were going to get a commitment. But there, it, you know, they didn't have a commitment because this other person was still connected to the past and won't let go of the past. And that could cause an angry outburst. So yeah, there's a lot of reminiscing. There's somebody here that will not let go of a past marriage or a past commitment or something like that. There may be another woman or another man and, you know, it causes chaos. It causes an uproar. I do believe that there is going to be some sort of battle okay with the five of swords reverse this is and then we had the five of wands earlier as well those are both conflict cards okay but the seven of swords there has been a serious betrayal here and it's about to be uh dealt with put it that way we got an unhappy camper that is probably going to explode This is whoever this person is that has involved themselves, you know, in a situation, you know, they should have fear in God, but this person doesn't have any fear of God, right? They don't. And I'm, and I'm not overly spiritual. I mean, I am spiritual, but godly. Um, I do believe in God, though, as you can tell, um, but this is person doesn't fear, doesn't fear God. They don't fear God. They don't, they don't fear a higher power. This is somebody that doesn't have any fear of God. Well, good luck. 